This video is a step-by-step -step guide that can help you set up Scorpbot in 15 minutes or less. Scorpbot is a free software for streamers that can be used as a single stream bot for either Beam or Twitch, or for casters who multi-stream to Beam and Twitch at the same time. But for this video, we're going to focus on Beam. By setting up a few commands in Scorpbot, you can add fun to your chat. You can add a point or currency system. You can add mini games, quotes, giveaways, song requests, and dozens of other features. But this video will set up just the basics to get you started and streaming quickly. So let's get into the setup. The first thing you want to do is download Scorpbot. Go to scorpbot.com and click download. The link will be listed in the description. Second, you will need two Beam accounts, a streamer account and a bot account. And these two accounts will need two different email addresses. So once you've set up your primary and secondary accounts, log into your secondary account on Beam. This is your bot account. Then open Scorebot. Click on Login and then click Bot Login. And then select the Beam tab. Now you'll need to generate an OAuth token. OAuth is short for Open Authorization. Type in your bot's name, type in the channel name, then in the same window, click Generate OAuth Token. A pop-up window will appear that will ask you to confirm that you are logged into Beam as your bot. Make sure that you are, then click OK. Another window will open, and this is where you will need to approve access to your Beam account. So go ahead and approve it, and this will generate your OAuth token for your bot. Copy and paste this code in the Bot OAuth Token window. Now it's time to get an OAuth token for your streamer account. But before you click Generate OAuth Token, log out of your bot account on Beam, and then log into your streamer account. Now you can click the Generate OAuth Token button in your streamer window. Again, a new window will pop up. This time you won't need to approve access since you already have. Copy and paste the code into the streamer window. Click Connect All, and both your bot and your streamer account should be connected to Scorebot. Now you're ready to input a few basic commands to get you started. To begin, click on the Commands tab. The first command we'll set up is the Shoutout command. A shoutout is a public message that lets your viewers know you support a specific person. Set the shortcut as exclamation point SO. The shoutout command is an easy one to set up because it's preset into Scorebot, so you'll simply select it in the prefab drop down menu and click load. A default message will generate that will show what will be displayed when you type exclamation point SO. Then click add save and your command will now work when you type exclamation point SO with a target in your chat. You can also set up an uptime command to show how long you've been streaming, and a raider command to shout out any caster who has raided you. Now let's move on to the quotes tab. This is where any notable sayings from anyone in your chat can be recorded. And an easy way to input the quotes is directly from the chat window. Simply type exclamation point quote add and then write your quote and who said it. Hit enter and the bot will also add the game currently being played and the date. So now you can either type exclamation point quote to generate a random quote, or you can type exclamation point quote and a number to bring up that specific quote. To delete a quote, type exclamation point quote delete and the number and it will be removed from Scorebot. Next, let's move on to giveaways. On the giveaways tab, you can set up contests for viewers to enter to win prizes. In the giveaway for box, type the prize that is being awarded. If you only want followers to be eligible, click the box that says followers only. The command to enter is preset to exclamation point enter, but you can change this command if you like. Under timers, select how long the giveaway will last, and then you can either click start, or you can type exclamation point giveaway start in your chat. The giveaway will end when the winner has claimed their prize or when you press cancel in Scorebot. Now these are just a few basic commands that will get you started using Scorebot, but there are many other features to this software, including song requests, points and currency systems, and alerts. If you'd like me to make more videos on Scorebot that go into detail for each tab, let me know in the comment section below. Until then, this is WASD, and I'll see you in the next video.